what's the current state of the debate within Christian philosophy concerning suicide? Um, it strikes me in regards to suicide, and I think there are, there are two sides. One, of course, would be to sort of invoke the idea that um, given that God has given us the gift of life, that this is a gift we can never reject, right? That, that, that it is not our position to reject this gift um, is something that we must, we must wait for God and God's timing in that regard. I think um, on another side of the debate, though, perhaps there's, there's the idea, um, given what we are increasingly learning about sort of um, depression and some of the causes of suicide and some of the biological and chemical things that can lead one to that, I think it's also there are those who would argue suicide is less of a moral decision, less the product of a free will decision, uh, and more sort of the outcome of, of a disease, so to speak. So in the same way that one would not want to find someone morally culpable for dying from cancer, similarly one would then say one is not morally culpable for dying from depression. So I think those are sort of the two big sides of that debate right now. Um, and I think you'll find Christians on who, who, who take uh, positions on both sides.